Uh, I still don't have a battery, so we have to go the long way around. It's not that long, though. And we still have to turn the water off, which we can't do. And we've got to run through the snakes. This is Brad. Come in, Stars Alpha Team. Come in. This is Jill. Does anybody hear me? I hear you, Brad. Over. Stars Alpha Team. Bravo Team. Doesn't matter. Respond. I repeat. This is Brad. Brad? Brad! This is Brad. If you can't answer me, somehow give me a sign. Jill to Brad. Can you hear me? Brad! Brad! Shit. It's broken. You gotta press the button, Jill. <laughs> Also, he could just tell us the relevant information. The secret to the upcoming puzzle is... Is that a... Yep. That's taking too long. That went pretty well, though. I was able to kill one of them with the pistol, but I did have to swap because I wouldn't have been able to kill the other one. This one took six shots. Should be dead. Um, I don't hear the crows anymore. Yeah, the crows are gone. But I still think that this is... Some kind of transparent creature is swimming around in the water. Is it a G? We still don't have the battery, so we gotta go, go out of here, go back. Ah, oh. uh, we're not poisoned. Jill needs to work on her trigger finger. You would think that you know it's a semi-automatic. Bang! Bang! <laughs> Yeah, I know. I should have just ran, but I didn't realize it was going to be snakes. Snakes? Oh my god, there's a lot of snakes. Caution, not poison though. We'll just uh, use that. I wonder if you could shoot the snakes. She, she's aiming at him, so shooting or maybe just using the knife. That'd be a little awkward, though, because the knife is super slow. So we've cleared out this room. Uh, there's more in that area, which we haven't done, which is surprising. That's a box. I remember this room. Whoa, there's stuff. Use this thing to protect yourself from that bulletproof thing in chains. I went ahead and fixed that piece of crap door to Barry. He fixed the door. Why, how is, why is he so good? You're so good at this, Barry. Acid shells for the shotgun? Because it said shells. Does Chris get all these bonus drops from Barry as well? Did I did I select easy mode accidentally by going for Jill? <laughs> Am I not getting the full experience? Deus Ex Machina? No, Deus Ex Barry. Zombies taking over, better do some house maintenance. 
Will you take the stone and metal object? Oh, we're gonna need that for later, huh? That's why the room is still lit up. Well, honestly, uh... We're gonna need this to get into the basement. Once we find the second one. We don't need it right now, we know where it is. Jill, easy mode besides easy mode. Like, is it... I, I'm very curious about this. Is that actually kinda what it is? What the heck? It's gonna be following me. Uh, this room is filled with zombies. I think it's gonna be following me. It might just be in this room. Woo! Jill was meant to be easier. See, I, I picked her just because she was the second character. I didn't realize there was actually going to be like a mechanical difference between the two runs. Very interesting. I gotta be honest though, I would hate this game with six inventory slots. <laughs> I would, I would be real annoyed. Whoa! At having only six inventory slots. Put one of these away. Got acid shells. We need the shotgun rounds. Thing in chains. This is not the thing in chains. This is a, a new enemy. I gotta imagine that maybe the flame rounds would still be nice to have, but. We got the sh we got so many shotgun rounds. We can just hold on to the shotgun for the time being. Okay, uh, helmet door. Upstairs, down the hall. These things are hurting. Is that it? I really thought they would be harder to take out than that. I should have just shot them the first time. They're fast, but they're not that strong. Clunk? Jill. When he wiggles, he's dead. Hopefully they don't get back up either. What the? Jill, tell me what this is. I mean, first of all, yes, I get that it'll crush me. If I push this in the middle of it, um, maybe the walls won't crush me. I also kind of want to go behind them. there. Run, 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 run.
So it just it just do, does a cycle, huh? Okay. Whoops, 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 whoops. I'm not Jill. Oh my god. Jill, 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 Jill. I don't know why that statue is there. That's... But I guess I don't know about a, a lot of what's happening right now. This is going to give me less time. But we can still make it. Uh, this is going to take a little while. I should probably push it away. puzzle. Like, I don't think I don't think I'll get crushed. But I, I need the I need the freaking wall to not move in anymore. Yeah, the next next up is push it to the side and maybe stop the walls. Like because may, maybe maybe if the walls stop, they won't move if I put uh, I don't know. This doesn't work. Yeah, that's the problem. You'll still get crushed. This is a highly stupid puzzle. <laughs> it's because it's, it's not a puzzle. It's just uh, game mechanics are a little wonky sometimes, you know. That's hard to do. Okay. So we gotta we gotta push it to the side and then we gotta push it back. Um, I think she, I just got her crushed. No, almost did. I just waste a couple of seconds, but let's see. Yeah, that's that's not enough time. Oh. oh excuse me. I should have muted myself. I apologize. Turn around. Yeah, engaging gameplay. Push puzzles. Like, oh my god. Is is this really what you got? I hate this. <laughs> I want I want this I want this one to get moved towards me cuz then I could stop the wall completely and then I could do the other one. But this is uh it's going to be a little tedious cuz I I have to push, stop pushing, move to the other side with the tank controls. Yeah, that's that's, this is not fun. <laughs> I, I wonder if I'm missing something. Better out than in. There might be something else in that room that I could use to stop the walls, because this is... This is very fiddly. But I think I just have to do it fast. Oh my god, I got... <laughs> I 
Okay, one more. We might want to come back to this room, because there might be uh, something else that we can do. Maybe I have to stand here? Nope. Anything on this side? Nope. Alright. I think we just have to do it. No, Jill! <laughs> For some reason in my head, I thought it would queue up the wall moving back. I wanted to test it. That's what I'll say. I'll say I wanted to test it. <laughs> God damn it. All right, it's just a run back. Usually you just need three rounds. The wall moves too fast. I'm, I'm trying to I'm trying to think about how I want to do this with the wall moving that quickly. Oh, I got it. Oh, you know what? This is going to be a very easy route. Um, and now I know I don't need any of this. So we can just dump, uh, dump all of this. Okay, we got We just got to go get the key. It'll take two seconds. Oh, wait, I didn't get the book! Hold on, did I do the book thing? Oh my god, hold on. Let me make sure I have the book. By the way, Poxies, I saw your uh, message earlier when you said that you were inspired to play Resident Evil 1 again. How long has it been since you last played this game and also... <laughs> have you played all the Resident Evils? Because that's my plan. My plan is to play all of them. Even if it's on Jill mode. This is me in my Resident Evil 2 hardcore run after I ran out of ink ribbon, says Connie. How'd you run out? I actually, uh, on my own, I played uh, Leon A-side hard mode. And it wasn't that bad. Now that I, after I understood how the game worked, I was able to actually get through it pretty quickly. Didn't S-rank it or anything, but it was a fun time. Oh, we gotta do this too. I really should have saved when we got back to the mansion. I will do that this time around. That's what happens when you're conditioned to save every so often. Yeah. I do wish that you could just, uh, have as Barry. many saves as you want, basically. Because really, it's a it's more of a convenience thing than anything else. You know, I don't want to be inconvenienced by not being allowed to save. Played the hell out of two and four remakes this year and played most of them. I'm hoping to play all of them. War Maulers, have a good night. Rip. Oops. Hold on, hold on. Got him. All right, we got the key. Uh, the mansion's gonna be filled with weird looking lizard creatures. But I've got my trusty shotgun. Oh, and there's gonna be the two dogs to deal with. Uh, we're hurt, if we get hit, we will heal. When we get back to the mansion, I will save, and then I'm gonna pick a different direction to go in because that, that puzzle sucked. I don't wanna have to do that push puzzle. She, she's so slow at pus pushing the statue, I don't know if she can make it. But there might be some something else that we can do in that room, like maybe we can just find a long bar. 
I don't know if I have Survivor or Code or Revelations. I have the main games. And he says, I have both revelations. Well, there you go. Hey, that actually went pretty easy. Uh, I killed the first dog in two shots instead of six shots. I don't know why this time he went down so easy. I believe all you have to do is push it onto the square and it goes in on its own, says Academy Kill. Yeah, I mean, can't help but feel like I was pushing it, but... Ah, damn it. I will, I will try again, I suppose. Poisoned. Interesting, I didn't get poisoned last time. Uh, I'm gonna heal. I can just chomp on a, uh, a blue herb when we get back. If I run back through the snakes, I could get a free blue herb, but then I'm just gonna get bit again, so we'll just do it like this. I have like five blue herbs. Jill. <laughs> Wasn't pushed in all the way. Is this the same problem I had? Yeah, the the night situation, where one of them just w was a pixel away from a wall. God damn it. Sometimes this goddamn game. Hmm. I wonder if first aid is a uh, anti-poison. All right. Well, I will. I will try to push those things in again. I'm also realizing if I take the emblem, I might. If you take the emblem, would that stop the enemies from getting through the door? Because the door would be locked, right? I really wish I could just like put something on the ground, but I can't. So screw it. Get the shotgun out. Whoa, 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 <laughs> I went around the table, got caught on it, and missed my exit. One more time. All right, take this one wide, and I think he'll miss me. Whee! All right. Now nah, we're fine. I would have laughed if it was still in the air mid-lunch. <laughs> I should have... I really wish I could split a stack. I should really have some health on me. Um, let me grab a first aid spray. I know I said I would save, but I want to kill this guy first, then we'll save. Because this is a hallway I'm going to go through, because it's got the save next to it. That's what I thought! The other door we might be able to run past, that dude, but I should probably go shoot him too. Oh my god. 
freaking inventory, man. What am I looking for? Down to six ink ribbons, but I still want to save. That, that was a lot of running to get back here, so this is a good time for it. All right, we got the health, we got the key, we got the guns. Let's do this. Played all the canon games. I didn't realize some of the Resident Evil games weren't canon. Does that, does that include five and six? <laughs> because that would be funny. All right, so we're gonna try this again. I'm just gonna push it all the way to the back wall, then all the way to the side wall. I'm gonna see if that slots it in on its own. Yeah, because you know what? That ex that's a good point. If we didn't slot it in fully, we could make this puzzle nearly impossible. So, here we go. Wait for it. How could Jill even, like, fathom that this puzzle requires this solution, you know? I certainly wouldn't think, maybe I have to push the block the statue to the other side of this wall crush. Maybe I should risk this. Risk my life on this. What am I doing with my life? Connie says, apparently from what I've read of the differences, Chris is faster and has higher crit chances in his game. Connie, does Chris have to fight the plant? that we fought, or didn't fight, that, that we just flamethrowed. Does Chris have to fight that thing? Because if so, we definitely got the advantage on our side, being Jill. Yep, yep, okay. You don't have to push it in. That makes, n th that makes no sense to me. Why, why was it, why would it automatically push in? <laughs> Whatever. What? There's a hole at your feet. You can't see very far into it. Go down? Chris has a smaller inventory and can't lockpick. So how does he get into those rooms that, that Jill can? Hey, the master of unlocking. Chris has to fight it. How does, how does Chris open up those doors that, um, that we lockpick? Are they just shortcut doors through the mansion, or what? More keys? Also, apparently Jill can too fight it if you don't mix the chemicals, says Connie. Really? Yeah, apparently I made it harder than it had to be, but also there's no indication that there's magical conveyor belts that are invisible that move the statues. How was I supposed to know? <laughs> um, I don't, I don't want to jump in the hole. But you know what? This is the second floor. We go down to the first floor, and we'll have stuff. We have stuff to access down there. So I actually think we will do it. See ya. Because this is just the first floor. Eagle of South, Wolf of North. Last book. Volume 1. Chris is basically the harder. I think it's better to play him after Jill. Oh, I'm probably not going to play through this again. <laughs> unless, unless there's substantial differences.
want to examine this. Metal was hidden inside. Is there a special way to use the metal? Well, we definitely don't need the book. November 29th, 1967. I can't get out. I've tried every possible way to escape, but only be defaced re with the reality that I'm trapped. I've been everywhere, man. I've been everywhere, man. The laboratory with the large glass tubes filled with formaldehyde, formaldehyde and those dark, wet, and eerie caves. What can I do? At first, I didn't want to believe my eyes, but that familiar high-heeled shoe in the corner, corridor, it was like reflex. One name came to my mind, Jessica. Are we gonna, are we gonna get the the Mario boot and wear it and jump on enemies? I don't want to believe they share the same fate as me. No, I can't give up hope. I have to hope they're alive. November 30th. I haven't had anything to eat or drink for the past few days. I feel like I'm going crazy. Why is this happening to me? Why do I have to die like this? I was too obsessed with designing this ghastly mansion. I should have known better. It was a dark and damp underground tunnel and another dead end, but even in the darkness, something caught my eye. Carefully, I lit the ma last match I had to see what it was, a grave. But deeply engraved into the stone was my name. George Trevor. At that instant, it all became clear to me. Those bastards knew from the beginning that I'd die here and I fell right into their trap, but it's too late now. I'm losing it. Everything is becoming so far away. Jessica, Lisa, forgive me. Because of my ego, I got both of you involved in this whole damn conspiracy. Forgive me. May God justify my death in exchange for your safety. George Trevor! George Trevor! Rip. Oh. I guess we are going down again. Down to the basement. There is something at the end of this hall. I don't know what it is. I would like to. Maybe. We have to kill the spider. We can't let the spider live. We gotta kill the spider. Could have maybe done it with the pistol. There's another spider. Also, is this thing like gonna poison me when I walk through it? Ugh. Jill. I knew it! How do I how do I get through it? Well, we got to get out of here. I guess by blowing it up, we release the poison sack, potentially. Which I guess is not a good thing. You know, I'm poisoned. I'm walking through here. No, this is a dead end. So we have to explore the dead end first. Is that a, did it say that that was a ladder? No, that was a ladder behind us. Okay. Well, there's an item in here we're missing. I feel like I shouldn't stay here and get poisoned, but... We've got the first aid spray if I need it. Ah! There it is. 
There's a map of the mansion basement. Do you want to take it? Why wouldn't you? So we, we can we can get out of here pretty quickly, which might keep us alive. I don't know if the spray removes poison. So I'd like to get hit and then use it. But I know we can open the door to the kitchen. Headshot. Also, plant. It looks like the poison just does damage over time, by the way. So let me let me see. That does not remove poison. Good to know. That was a test. So we blew the head off of one of them. This one might come back to life. It was only a test of the medical diagnostic system. Um, I guess let's go this way. Probably should not interact with the thing that'll kill me. Unless I'm supposed to interact with it. But I am standing in waist-high water, so... Let's, uh... I feel like, I, I think, feel like I'm gonna explore first. Because there is a lot to the mansion to explore, still. We've got the helmet key. And maybe we can find a way of turning off the power, flipping the switch, then turning it back on. Waste high water seems to me to be the uh, game indication of don't don't turn the switch. You know, the game's saying do this and you'll die. I, I'm hearing that. What is with the music? I see ankles at most. I'm gonna go to the typewriter. I wanna go. Okay! Knife. He was one bullet away from dying. But he didn't do he, he didn't do damage because we uh well he didn't do much damage on his swipe, but man, I wish you could fire faster, Jill. We also don't have the yellow gem. Second floor, there's a lot of doors. We can go to the second floor down the hall. And there's a save point. We don't need to save though. I might want to save just because of the damn puzzle though. Nah, we should we should save. Yo, the door was broken. I don't remember that. Okay, weird. Now we're gonna get value out of all this pistol ammo I've been saving. Nyong. One less loading screen. It makes me wonder why they even had the loading screen if they didn't need it, you know? Barry used it to replace the other door. I like that idea. He had to take the parts out of one door to fix the other one. Medal of the Eagle. I got no idea. I feel like I should take, like, the wood mount. I feel like we're about to need a puzzle that uses this, so why don't we just grab it? Berry! If I'm the master of unlocking, Berry's the master of carpentry. 
Up the stairs, door on the left. Left door on the left. Probably won't need the emblem. I'm gonna hold it, but... bird is moving. That's creepy. I don't think we need the emblem, and I don't think it goes in the gravestone. The six-pointed emblems go in the gravestone. Acor, welcome! Thank you for the raid. How's it going, everybody? What were you playing before you decided to raid me? My, my raid command has been broken for years, and I haven't fixed it. Resident Evil! Imagine that! <laughs> This is my first time playing Resident Evil HD. And I played Resident Evil 2 a couple weeks ago. Now we're playing HD. I've never played the Resident Evil games before. The eyes glow blue. What, 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 what do you do? was doing retro achievements for the OG Resident Evil. I'm just playing Resident Evil to to, to... to just play it, to have a good time playing it, and to understand the game and its impact on gaming. That bird is psychic. It does look... it's like... it's a bird that only looks at you... if you're standing... in certain parts of the room. Stop! Pushing the table, lady. Mail to the chief. X day is drawing upon us. Execute the following procedures within one week. Prompt actions are demanded. Lure stars to the estate. Obtain bow. Or bow. Raw combat data against stars. Collect two embryos of each mutated specimens as samples. Excluding the tyrant. Dispose of the tyrant. Ensure complete disposal of all of disposal of all Arclay Laboratory. Sorry, misread this. Ensure complete disposal of the Arclay Laboratory, including all personnel and test animals. Disguise their deaths as an accident. When the above procedures are executed, report to headquarters for further instructions. If for some reason you're unable to execute, report immediately. In case of emergency, report directly to the extension number 5691. Good luck, Umbrella. Why, that seems evil of them. Would you mind it if I push this bird? They are cartoonishly evil. Alright, I cannot interact with you right now. What if we push this one? I, I'm half expecting this eagle to shoot laser beams or something. It just, it looks so strange. It's got purple glowing eyes. Can, can I not interact with it at all? It kind of looks like it, it's it got an item of some sort. And it goes clunk clunk when it's looking at the, uh, the bison or something. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Light switch. Oh, there's a red light. In the eye there. Hold on. And when it's looking directly at it, it pulsates. Is there something on- oh, there's a dagger on the wall. I, that's what was flashing. That's why I thought I could interact with the eagle, but no, it's just this. A 
watching you, watching you, watching you. That disables that one. I don't know, like... So you have a purple eye, that's a red light, that's a green light. It's one of those things where it's like, I don't even know where to begin in solving this puzzle. Let me turn the light back on. Just figured this out. Like, I kind of want to just, like, shoot the damn thing. nothing to interact with either except for this but she just jumps onto it and then can't do anything get off of it maybe we have to uh, push these against the left and the right wall and then interact with the statues so let me let me reset the tables it's the only other thing I can really think of give it a try uh, watching you watching you Turn this off so that she knows that those lights are there. Imagine if you had to reload. Push this over. Must be flush. A glowing yellow jewel sits in the eye. Would you like to take it out? It's attached to something and refuses to budge. Is this maybe where we have to we have to beat it? Lol. Cause it might be locked in. Yeah, okay. So I think we have to just beat the out beat the eel. Please get off, thank you. Because it doesn't follow us at a certain angle. No, 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 no. no. Ha ha! Now, I did take too much garbage. <laughs> we might have to drop some garbage off to finish the rest of the puzzle, but I got one of them. And I know where it goes, so we can go drop it off. It goes down here. Watching you, watching you. Jill, 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 Jill. press Y, Jill! Jill! <laughs> He's getting up. We can pistol him. I feel like there's another one. No, we don't have any more ammo. That's okay. Okay. There's another one. I knew there was music playing. He was there. Thank God you can reset the puzzles. Put a board on the window. Do you think that's actually what this is? Wooden mount? No, it's a mount. We gotta put someone's head on this. It's a good idea, though. I wouldn't have thought of that. It didn't have yellow stripes on it. <laughs> yellow tape, rather. All right. My bad. Alright, what are you gonna give me? More shotgun ammo? A CD. Dude, I can play this on my PlayStation. Hey, Quark, welcome. Happy Sunday, how are you doing today? Do 
Shazam. Mo disc. Here's to be a disc for rebooting a system of some sort. Alrighty then. More puzzle items. Of course it's a mini disc. I got another puzzle item. I thought I was just gonna get rid of that inventory slot, but because I'm not, I guess let's go put some stuff away. Where this guy is. Because he's not there. How 90s of them. Yeah, nowadays it would just be on like a thumb drive. <laughs> I'm gonna put the wooden mount away. I should not have taken it. Still feel like I should take the middle of the eagle, but we probably don't need that. Quirk says, I felt like an idiot. Went to the store earlier, went to pay, had left my wallet on my desk. Felt very dumb. Oh no. Connie says, happens to all, happens to the best of us. And that's how you know it had to happen to Quirk, the best of us. Is not the right direction. Yeah, all this for three metals. We should just shotgun the lock on the door. He's up here. Well, hopefully, oh, I should have brought HP. Hopefully, you uh, still got your foodstuffs. Says if I'm the best of us, we need to try harder. <laughs> Where am I going? Oh no, it is this hallway. Okay. All right, we're in the watching you puzzle. Uh, we need to get the red one. Yo, apparently you can just flick the right stick and you turn around. I did not know that. Chakonk! Alright. Come this way. Hey Cork, you can you can see if you can solve this puzzle <laughs> this, as we're uh solving some Resident Evil style puzzles here. There we go. Easy. Now I've got the red gem. What does it do? I got no idea, but I have it now. Turn the light back on. I'm gonna cost Umbrella so much money and wasted electricity. <laughs> All right, uh, door at the end of the hall on the right. I'm also going to make sure I have one heal on me, which I should have should have made sure of before. That might be the first non-candlelight I've seen in the mansion, says Connie. There's plenty of lights. So much garbage. And we want a heal. Let's go. You know, I'd say we should probably save, but we haven't actually done that much. 